Okay, hello everyone, Mr. CPC here. Um, I haven't been uploading very much because I've just had a week of exams, but now they're done, so I should be able to do a lot more stuff now and film a lot more videos. Um, I wanted to have this video, I wanted to do like a little commentary video, like, you know, Technoblade did back in 2018, something, I don't know. I want to do a commentary video where I just talk about stuff and, I don't know, just get a video where I can get mid-roll ads, if that's even a thing, if you're not monetized. So basically, um, my first thought is, um, I, the reason I haven't been uploading too much is because I've just been playing a ton, like I've just recently started playing Hypixel, because I have a confession to make, I'm really sorry about this, and I do feel bad, but don't worry about it, because I, I have, basically, before, like, as of... Before my two latest videos, before that, I was playing on Pirated Minecraft, and that really made me feel bad, because I really liked Mojang, and doing that made me feel really bad about it, so I organized an extremely <laughs> work, and eventually bought the actual game, so now I have a skin, and an account, and everything, so I started playing Hypixel, and I've had a lot of fun, and I just haven't <laughs> had the time to upload. Uh, yeah, so, also, um, yeah, so I feel really bad about pirating, but then again, like, I had a lot of obstacles blocking me from getting it, that are really hard to explain, I just, this video would last like an hour if I tried, so I won't bother, um, basically, I've been playing a lot of Skyblock as well, and I understand, holy shit, I understand how people get, like, addicted to that game, like, I, I genuinely understand why, like, because you could just sit there for hours grinding at that game, like, I, I understand how something like that can happen, already, like, and not only that, but, like, the community, like, to new players, like, to noobs, are, like, really, like, kind of nice, because, like, It'd just be like a random day in, Hope, in Skyblock. I'd just be walking around the hub and like, I look at this rare diamond I got from the deep caverns and I thought to myself, huh, um, what's this do? And it said, oh, you, re you can you put, put this on like a diamond thing and add the reforged like ability to it. Uh, dungeon blacksmith. I'm like, oh, okay, where's the dungeon blacksmith? Which I can know that. So I just typed in chat, uh, hey, anyone know where the dungeon blacksmith is? And then this guy, like, oh yeah, Mr. Seepy's come here. He pulls me off, like, he, he, like, takes me over to the, like, the bank for some reason, and then he just drops three, like, pants, boots, and a helmet of this super OP, like, super skeleton soldier something armor. I think it's like, all these enchantments and all of this maxed out stuff, and I'm just like, holy shit. Like, I literally just asked where the dungeon black- he didn't even show me where the dungeon blacksmith was after that, he literally just gave me overpowered gear for no reason. I'm just like, oh, geez, Jesus, thank you very much. Yeah, so... And then there's been other times where I've just been given gifts from someone and I was trying to find something else as well. Like, I just really like this guy's looking like, it's, it's a better change from having to report a hacker over a single game in Sky Wars. Um, yeah, so, yeah, that's another thing I've experienced. I'm, I'm get, I figured out that, like, I prefer playing Bed Wars to Sky Wars because Sky Wars is just, like, everyone's good at the game. And not only that, but like, also everyone's either hacking or, or just really good at the game, so I can't do much about it, because I'm really new. Whereas Bed Wars, a lot of people are still new, there's still thousands of people on there, so it's a lot easier to like, get better at the game. Which I have, I've, I like playing Bed Wars, it's really fun. Um, what else? Um, hmm. There ain't much else really. Oh yeah, right, my main point of this video. I'm probably not going to include the video, but you'll, you'll see when the video goes out or when you clicked on it. Uh, basically, I have a reason, and this is just my opinion, so like, don't, if I get a thousand dream stands coming at me, like, just because I stated my opinion, as I'm allowed to under the Australian Const Constitution, then that kind of sucks, but I feel like the dream is in peace, and... Um, and don't take this the wrong way, the Dream SMP has ruined early, early game YouTube. I'm gonna explain whenever you play that. 
when I say that YouTube, when I say that Dream SMP has ruined the um, early game of YouTube, when a YouTuber like first starts, they've got like zero subs, they start making videos that are relevant to like what's around these days, and I get that, like that makes sense, that's just going on the times, like when all those videos like, oh will this work in Minecraft, like um, that Stevy guy who was actually a complete scammer, and Alexa Real and all those guys were doing those types of videos, I did one, and it's now one of the most viewed videos on my channel, but yeah, so I can understand why people do that, and that gets subscribers, that gets views, that gets attention. But then there's also things like, that. that's still putting your own work in, that's still creating something of your own work and then putting it on YouTube, that's, like, that's fine. Whereas, what's happened a lot, and what's become sort of a thing now, is clip channels. Basically, people that on YouTube, that take people, that take the content of the VOD footage, from other streamers, like, footage on Twitch, and then put it onto YouTube, and then, their ch and then their channel gets attention, subscribers, views, all that, from something that isn't actually their work, and they end up getting all this attention, and, like, some of these channels are even monetized at this point, and, like, they still, and it's none of their work, none of it's theirs. So I just feel like, me trying, so I just feel like it's kind of a cheap way to do it, like, I'm trying to do it legit, like, I made, like, one or two Dream SMP videos, and I deleted them after I realized it was just cheap, and I've gotten, like, nearly 50 subs without much interference with, into that section of stealing other people's content, stealing other people's clout, like, the videos that I've made that have used that haven't gotten much have used like the Dream SMP like relevance, haven't gotten any views anyway, so I don't really care. Like, I just feel like people, it's a lot easier to just like make a ton of video, make like just, it's a lot easier to just take people's content, put it on YouTube, and then get a lot of subs, and then start making actual videos and like collabs with other people, because then they'll be more noticeable anyway, because I think the algorithm doesn't, I'm pretty sure the algorithm recognizes like bigger YouTubers, like, content, more than smaller people's YouTube content, and puts it in your recommended section, so, I feel, it's just, like, a really cheap way, and I don't like it, so that's just my opinion on how it's, like, really YouTube and made it a lot harder for people who actually want to, like, you know, make new content, new ideas, and put it on YouTube and get views, apart from just posting Dream SMP content. I don't know, it just really annoys me. Like, I've got maybe, like, one or two mates that do, like, try and make YouTube videos, and I watch their videos, they're pretty good at what they do, and then again, though, like, they don't get as much views as the clip, the average clip channel, who just posts, like, a, a Technoblade clip, or a Tommy in it, like, Tommy in a 100 IQ moment thing, and gets a million views in a day.